Hello and welcome to today's Smartsheet tutorial where I will be showing you how to hide and unhide columns in a Smartsheet or a grid as we know from the Smartsheet terminology. So what I've done here is I've just created a brand new sheet, we've got no data in here at the moment and I've added two columns to the end which we are going to be using for this demo. So in order to hide a column you basically select the column that you would like. So I've selected the first column here. If we want to select multiple columns, then we can hold shift on our keyboard and left click on our mouse and that will select both columns. Right click and we want to select the hide column button and that will remove the column from the view. So as you can see, columns are completely hidden. Now you're probably thinking, how do we get these columns back? Well, what you need to do is you need to kind of hover over where you can see the columns are kind of meant to be. We right click here and then we select unhide all columns and we get both of our columns back. Now, one thing to note, as you see there, it said unhide all columns. You can't unhide one column. You you have to unhide all hidden columns in one go and then you can you'd have to un, you'd have to hide the column again individually so it is only possible to unhide unhide everything at, in one go so you can't do unhide individually um, apart from that other things to kind of um, to, to to mention is you can only kind of hide up to five columns at a time um, so if you had a, a sheet that had you know multiple um, columns it wouldn't be possible to do any more than than five so just bear that in mind as well I don't know why I'm adding a test column completely irrelevant but anyway hope this video was useful um, if it was please do hit the like button and subscribe I've got a lot of smart sheet training videos on my channel that you may want to check out and I also have a smart sheet training course for project managers I will leave it a link in the description of that and for that if you do want to check it out and I would recommend it if you're looking at the basics of Smartsheet. So with that said, I hope you have an excellent day.